We updated the board while you were out. In today's Gotham Minute, we focus on a prominent and often controversial figure, Oswald Cobblepot. The most infamous, if not famous, member of Gotham's long-established Cobblepot family. Thinking about what happened at Blackgate, Master Tim? We should have known Harley would try something. Now she's off to do... Harley stuff. She hasn't left any other messages or maps. Do you have any leads on where she might have gone? Not yet, but she's worked with the freaks before. Maybe they know something? A good place to start, then. Wow. Harley's profiled some seriously antisocial prisoners here. Look, something's going on at Blackgate. We lean on that warden, we're set. These records go back centuries, man. The Warden's new. Now she's involved. How did I miss this? Oh, right. Harley's stupid system makes no sense. Babs. Hey, Babs, what did you figure out? <laughs> they all got out on appeal. That's what Harley was tracking. In every case, key witnesses were murdered. Look, they were all pinned up with knives, just like Langstrom. Bruce is onto something. Oh? I think I've got something. Oswald Cobblepot, the Penguin. He's like everyone else in here, except he served his sentence every single time he was arrested. Someone must have hung him out to dry. Might be he's willing to talk. He runs the Iceberg Lounge now. Claims he went legit. <laughs> he definitely runs more than liquor through that bar. I wouldn't know. That man would never take me. <laughs> if you wanted a fake ID, Tim, all you had to do was ask. Oswald's dangerous. And we can't forget, Harley's still out there. You have to be careful. Relax, dick. We got this. Visit him. I could what? He went to yours when you could visit his grave. You haven't. <laughs> I'm not the one staring at the you know. Sometimes you're an idiot, Grayson. up for clocking. A cobble pot coin. Should have just put a penguin on it. U.S. tax code. Doubt penguins well acquainted with that. I 
you know what they say, boomerangs always come back. Let's hope the captain doesn't. Thanks to Penguin, I'm scared of umbrellas. Ain't seen the bear. <clears throat> Something's definitely off. Door sandalwood, custom job. Fixing it's gonna be a pain in the ass. I have questions. Tell me what you know when I leave. Smile. Viral video of you assaulting a reformed citizen is the last thing you need right now. Reformed, huh? I believe that when I see it. It is weird you did your time, though. Unlike your friends. Hmm. Someone's done their homework. Who's giving out the get-out-of-jail-free cards? If you really want to go down this rabbit hole, you need to know there's no coming back from it. Just tell me what I need to know. I'm gonna spell this out for you. With the back gone, you're not worth my time. Get lost. Beat it! Belfry, our friend Cobblepot wasn't in the mood to chat. Whatever he knows, he won't say. All right, come back to the Belfry and we'll regroup. Sounds good. See you there.
Penguin wouldn't talk. I don't have the same sway here I had back in Bloodhaven. You may be surprised to learn Batman struggled with similar challenges early in his career. So for a time, he focused his energies elsewhere in the city. When word of his work got out, people were more inclined to cooperate. The city. We've been so caught up in Batman's last case, we haven't been paying attention to the rest of Gotham. Gotham may not know Batman is gone, but it certainly feels his absence. There has been a marked increase in gang-related crime. Plus Penguin's own businesses. Maybe if we pay those a visit, take care of a few of the crimes, he'll be ready to talk. You've also received messages from Lucius Fox and Detective Montoya. They may be able to help. <sighs> Thanks, Alfred. Batman's gonna be a tough act to follow. You never were one for stage fright. An encrypted message from Fox Tecker. It's Lucian. Sorry I've been a ghost since the funeral, but I just realized I forgot to send flowers. If you're ever in the neighborhood, let's meet in my building. I'd like to give you them in person. Lucius Fox wants to give us flowers. Does he know couriers exist? Knowing Lucius, I suspect he has something far more useful for us. When you reach Fox Tecker, head straight to the roof. Enjoying the view, Lucius? <laughs> you trying to give me another heart attack? Batman taught you everything, huh? Batman was always big on keeping a step ahead of everyone. Don't know how he kept up with Gotham, though. I always feel five steps behind this city. You're getting there. The bat doesn't fall far from the belfry. From what I've seen, anyway. Thanks, I guess. Don't thank me yet. The mentor and I always knew that something like this could happen. When I left Wayne Tech, we kept some research going. There are a lot of eyes on you now. No one's looking at Fox Tecca. As long as I got a breath between the gills, You'll still have everything you need to carry on Batman's legacy. Speaking of which... 
You gonna introduce me? It's Luke's design. A custom bird to help you get around a little quicker. Hefty enough to support exactly one hero. Our own personal rideshare. This is great, Lucius. Now you can thank me. Thanks.
Careful. If they spot me, who knows what they'll do. Somewhere fast. I've contacted Dr. Tompkins. She'll be due to drop site. Dr. Tompkins, I have an organ donation for you. Nothing surprises me anymore with these gangs. Thanks for the delivery. I've got a medical team lined up who can use it. I'll be sure to add medical courier to my resume. <laughs> 